Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing a Ciate nail polish haul and this is going to be part one and there's going to be part two coming up soon. So if you want to see what I bought from Ciate from their Christmas collection from their Manny Month advent calendar, then carry on watching. So the first nail polish is called Chain Reaction. This is a gorgeous shimmery purple. It is so, so pretty. When I applied it, it's really thick and you only need one coat. The next polish is called Lucky 7. This is a coral pink. This is quite sheer, so you will need two coats for this, but it looks absolutely gorgeous. Next is Gold Digger. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love this polish. This is one of my favorites. This is gold with shimmery pigments and it looks absolutely beautiful. The next polish is Pool Party. This is a navy blue and looks absolutely beautiful, but you will need to apply two coats as it is quite a sheer polish. The next polish is called Ice Frappe and this is a nude pink. This looks really pretty. I think you only need one coat for this as it is quite opaque. The next polish is called Seize the Day and I love that name. I think that's a really good play on words. And I think this is a really pretty color. It is a turquoisey green. The next is Ibiza Blues and this is a beautiful lilac polish and I absolutely love this. This is definitely another one of my favourites that I got from my Manny Month advent calendar. Next is called Rain Check. This is a purpley blue colour. It's more purpley actually now I look at it. The next polish is this beautiful colour and it's called Cupcake Queen. This is a pink colour with some shimmery pigments in it and I absolutely love this. I love how the shimmery pigments are actually quite subtle so it's actually quite a subtle look which I love. Next is Raising the Bear and or Bar, I'm not sure. This is a really really deep red. It looks like brown in the bottle but is a very deep red. Next is called Cookies and Cream and I have two similar polishes. This is the first brownie colour, it's like a beige. This is Cookies and Cream and the next one is called Pretty and Putty. This is very similar to the other one. So they're quite similar but uh, I think one's a bit more opaque than the other. Next is a gorgeous emerald green called La Dolce Vita and this is really really pretty. I love an emerald green. They are always one of my favourite colour of polishes. Next is called Baudoir or Baudoir. Yeah, Baudoir, I think. This is a cherry red and this is very, very pretty and goes really well with the navy blue. This one is called Plie Please Me, I think that's how you say it. This is a, not so holographic, I think it's more of a silver polish, but it has a sort of shimmer to it. It has some hints of purple in there when you adjust the light and it does look very very pretty. Next is called Antique Brooch. We're now getting into the glitter polishes. This is a gold and pink glitter polish. Very very pretty. This is definitely a thick glitter polish as the glitter pigments are definitely more showy. So what I did for this polish is I put some on a sponge and then I dabbed the sponge onto the nail and this actually made the glitter much more thicker but I'm not sure if I like the effect but the glitter polish is absolutely beautiful and I think you just have to take a bit of time to make sure that the glitter is definitely not too bumpy on your nail and doesn't look a bit messy. Next is Risky Business, definitely one of my favourites. It reminds me of mermaids and I love it and definitely this on top of a blue polish would look gorgeous. Next is Fortune Teller, another one of my favourite glitter polishes. I'm never one to turn down a silver glitter polish. This is definitely a beautiful one. I love how small the sequins are as well so it's not too thick. Next is Meet Me at Midnight. This was one of the bigger nail polishes you got on the 24th of December, just before Christmas. And this is a red, I think it's red and pink glitter. It's not as thick as the others, but I definitely love this. This will look really pretty on top of a red polish. I just dabbed it on using a sponge just so you can see the after all effect, so you can see what it actually looks like when it's more onto the nail. And it definitely looks more red, but I love it. So thank you for watching guys, I really hope you enjoyed this nail art haul. All these polishes are from the advent calendar from 2016 for Christmas. So if you want to, you, you can probably buy it maybe, I'm not sure if it's still in stores or not. But if not, you can probably buy all these polishes individually on the Seattle website. I will link the website down below. So thank you for watching guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you'd like to, please get a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys! Yeah, yeah. Yeah.